What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, hello, welcome. My name is Brittany, and I would love it if you would consider subscribing to my YouTube channel. Follow me on Instagram and definitely turn your notifications on so you never miss an upload by me. Today's video, I will be reviewing some hair extensions that I received in the mail just recently, about two weeks ago, and I've been wearing them on and off, and I'm absolutely obsessed. So I wanted to review those for you, and yeah, I'm so excited to be partnering with Amazing Hair Beauty for this video. So definitely give this video a thumbs up if you're interested in seeing um, how these extensions work, how they look, how I style them, then just keep on watching. All right, so the brand is Amazing Hair Beauty, so thank you so much for sponsoring today's video. Um, they did send me this hair um, to review, so I was super excited to get them. I actually talked to them months ago when we finally got something worked out, um, and they sent these hair extensions to me about two to three weeks ago, and literally right when they came in the mail, I dropped what I was doing and got them out of the box and put them in my hair, styled them. They are 100% Remy Human Hair. They're 22 inches long and I believe they're 140 grams um, also. I was going to get the all bleach blonde color, but then um, I told them I wanted the bleach blonde, but that was before I had to dye my roots um, like this. If you didn't see me <laughs> messing up my hair. Um, in a video a while ago, I'll link it up here, you guys can watch that. I was trying to give myself baby highlights and I pretty much turned all this up here orange. Um, it's still pretty warm colored toned or whatever, but so I decided to change my color that I had picked out with them to balayage instead so that I would have the root colors match better and uh, I'm super glad I picked that because the roots look really good. I will. Um, insert a clip of me toning my hair extensions because when I got the color it was a little bit brassier than what my blonde is. So I actually toned the hair extensions and it took the chemicals just fine. They did not ruin them whatsoever so I'm super impressed with that honestly. Um, and I just really looked up YouTube videos on how to tone hair extensions and there was a bunch of videos about how to t tone those specific ones. Um, but all you do is pretty much just wash them with purple shampoo and it'll tone them. Um, so I will insert the clip now. So I'm filming this part like way before I'm actually filming the video you're watching right now. But I just wanted to show you how the extensions came, like the original color, because I'm going to tone them. But this is the color. I've curled them and styled them because I want to see what they look like right when I got them because I was super excited. But this is the color they look like. Let me turn you around. So this is the color. I wanted the root color because that's going to match my roots really well. But the blonde isn't as um, like icy as my blonde, which my blonde isn't super icy, but it's definitely not as yellow and brassy as this. So it just came in this box, but I am going to tone it. So what I did was just put a bowl of water in here, warm water, and then I just squeezed some of this purple shampoo. I I really just found this video on YouTube on how to tone your hair extensions. So I'm going to do that really quickly. And that's just to like turn them not brassy anymore. So wish me luck. And hopefully if you're watching the video, they turned out really well. So and my baby is crying. Hair. So I need to go help. <laughs> no, not purple hair. All right. So I have all the extensions laying out here. It looks like a ton of hair because it is. But hold on, baby. So I toned them all and then um, I let them sit here while I toned them, toned like every strand. And then I went back to the first strand that I did and I conditioned it. So I drained that water in the sink and then put new water in it and then used like a conditioner packet. And I washed all of these with conditioner just so that they would be nice and soft and hydrated. And I just kind of used my wet, wet brush to, I laid them all out and then I just, ran a wet brush just down them so that they could evenly dry. I haven't decided if I'm gonna take a hair dryer to dry them because I really want to try to style them and see how they look like now, but I might just let them air dry. We'll see. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and grab the extensions. All right, so it came in a box like this, just amazing beauty hair extensions, and it's 100% human hair. Um, Remy, Remy human hair, I will leave literally everything about the extensions down below in the description box if you want to know like specific details but um in this box it just came the hair in this like net 
right here. It also came with this super nice clip, which I absolutely love these. Um, I used to have one and I lost it or it broke it, I'm not really sure. But I saw I got another one, I'm really excited because this is just super easy to like, you know, clip your hair back and all that out of your face. Just, it comes in handy for sure. And then it, um, the hair also came in this bag as well. But it comes with just like this paperwork, um, basically just about instructions on care, how to wash it. Um, this is like you can use heat on it and everything, which is I absolutely love because you can get some at hair extensions and they're like synthetic and literally they'll just melt right on your hair straightener or on your curling iron. I've done that before. So make sure if you're using heat on your hair extensions, they are heat resistant. Um, and then they came with two extra clips and they also came with a, um, one of these teasing combs with a, like this end, which I love. I used to have one and this broke off of it. So I'm super pumped that they came with a new one. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and get these out. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and get the hair extensions out of the black netting. And like I said, I've already used this before a couple times. I've curled them twice already. Um, and so I just put them back in the, you know, netting or whatever. So I'm going to brush this. Oh, let me get that net off there. Um, but yeah, so when I was towing these, I was, you know, super nervous because I didn't want the chemical to like mess them up or anything or like break off the hair, but it was super good. And like literally there was maybe like two pieces of hair that even fell off of this. So I was super impressed with that. And this is a really, um, you know, it's thick hair as you can tell. And, you know, I just literally just ran a brush through it. And it's just super silky and soft, soft. I can't talk, but yeah. And this is only the 140 grams. Like if you got like a bleach bond, they have up to 220 grams. So literally almost double of this. Um, but yeah, so, but my hair isn't really thick. Um, as you can see, it's not thick like at all. So, but it's definitely not super thin, but it's definitely not thick. So this is just like the perfect, um, yeah. And as you can tell, the blonde matches really, really well. I did tone it and it was super easy to tone as you saw in the video. So yeah, I'm super happy with it. And I'm gonna go ahead and show you how I install these and yeah so this came with seven pieces like i said all of the like description of the hair will be in the description box below but it came with four or three i can't talk it came with seven pieces let me get them let me put them down real quickly so it came with one um four clip piece so just like that and the clips are really nice and heavy duty and yeah, didn't have any issues with the clips at all. And it came with two of the three pieces, uh, three clip pieces. And then there's four two clip pieces. And you know, they're just really nice, really high quality. The band is, you know, they're, the clips are sewn in really well. So super, super impressed impressed with this hair so typically when I do hair I you know start with my hair just like brushed out um you want to make sure you do have something like a teasing comb so that you can tease your hair a little bit so it has something to stick to because if your hair is just straight like this and you stick the clip onto it it's going to slowly just slide down because it doesn't have anything to grip onto let me show the back Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and part my hair. So I just kind of start right above my ears and just go all the way across. And this is where you wanna use your clip. So I just use my clip and so you guys can see. And I'm gonna go ahead and just tease right here so that when I clip it on, it'll have something to clip onto. So, I just keep dropping everything. All right, let me, I have a mirror right here, so. You, know, you just want a back comb. So 
so it has something to grab onto. So I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's all, you know, probably looks crazy, but now you're just going to, you know, make sure it's brushed out nicely. And the curls kind of look a little whack just because they were curled and then they were kind of rolled up in there, but you just want to open the clips up and then you will just flip it and clip. So I'll try to turn around so you guys can see. Hopefully this looks okay. So just looks like that. You guys can see. And these are obviously super long. <laughs> I love the length of them. Um, I think I might even like trim them. I wanted to wait till I finished this and did this video. Oh, I just realized my cardigan was tucked into my leggings, so that's nice. Um, hopefully that wasn't in the video, but anyway. Um, so yeah, this is what that part looks like. Obviously, this is my hair and this is this. The more hair you put into it, the more it'll look more natural. And then when we style it, Sometimes I like to curl my hair, like I will curl, I will clip one piece in and then style all of my hair and this with it. And then sometimes I will put all the extensions in and then style it with it because I don't really want to add a bunch of curls to my regular hair because I like the loose wavy look of the extensions. I don't want like a bunch of ringlets. So I think for this video, I'm just going to do this put them all in and just see how they look without me even doing anything to my hair. And then we might add in a few curls. So I'm going to go ahead and do the next layer. I want to do it all with you by my side. If you're in, meet me here tonight. Be brave and come along. I'll be your right. Promise we don't need no break lights. We can travel the world, so just say yes. recommend um, curling your hair with the extensions when you are first doing it obviously this my extensions were already like curled because I've already worn them um, and honestly it's just late at night and I just don't really feel like um, putting a ton of effort into my hair but let me just show you this is my regular hair So, you know, you just do one of those easy beachy waves and it just matches perfectly with the regular hair. So these extensions came straight. So you can see, you can, you know, brush them. And 
I will probably be getting them trimmed. I just didn't want to do it until this video was filmed, you know. Um, but yeah, these are the hair extensions. I love them. I think they're super pretty. And I need to uh, recurl them. But this is just what it looks like right now. I will insert some pictures of them when I just freshly curled them right here and here. This was last week um, on Mother's Day. I decided to put the extensions in and style them. And um, I'll go ahead and curl these pieces just so you guys can see it a little bit. I want to get my wand or a new wand. Mine broke. Um, but you can see. It curls really pretty so just like that um, I do recommend not like putting a ton of heat on the end just like regular hair you don't want to put a bunch of heat on the ends of your hair just to try to keep them as nice as possible I would not put a bunch of product on these also just because you want to keep them as clean and as nice as possible you don't have to wash them all the time because the more you wash them obviously the more they're gonna have damage and all that um, so yeah you just want to kind of like try to curl them good and let them be curled for a while. But I just don't do the ends and I just, you know, do that little beach wave curl. And then I just let them sit out. But I won't do the whole head of hair right now just because it's literally almost 10 o'clock at night. And I just wanted to... Get this video up and film for you guys so you guys can check them out because I have a lot of questions. I posted these on my Instagram, um, showed them to you guys over there. If you don't follow me, definitely check me out there. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And again, thank you so much, Amazing Beauty Hair Extensions, for sponsoring today's video. I will be working with them in the future. Um, so definitely stay tuned for them um, or for those videos and more hair looks from them but yeah if you guys are interested definitely check out the link below um, or the description box below there's also a ten dollar off coupon code i think it's ten dollars off um down there below i'll post it here as well I'm not, I'm not sure what it is off the top of my head but definitely check it out give this video a thumbs up it'll really help me out and i hope you guys enjoyed this review on these hair extensions and yeah i know a lot of you guys were asking me about them and how i like them because you guys were interested in getting some hair extensions as well. So I was really excited to review them for you guys. So I definitely recommend them and I, I love them, I'm obsessed. And yeah, I'm just, I'm all about the long hair vibes. If you didn't follow me like a year ago, I had just, I had chopped my hair off like literally like here. And um, I loved it for a while and I wore that, you know, all while I was pregnant. I'm three weeks postpartum right now. Um, and I'm like, my hair is now, as you, as you saw, this is my regular hair. So it's definitely grown a lot. Um, but I'm like, this is, this is more like it. <laughs> I absolutely love the long hair and I know I can't stop touching it, but I'm just obsessed. So anyway, I'm going to leave. So I don't keep, I don't keep annoying you guys, but, um, thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.